I wanted to show you a new app I found in the iTunes App Store called Easy Annotate, two PDFs side by side on iPad. Now, if you've ever used uh, two PDFs before, maybe switching back and forth between different languages, you'll notice that you can't view these two PDFs at the same time. Perhaps you've used a four finger swipe gesture to move between apps, or just taking a look at, uh, on PDF Expert, you can use different tabs to look at documents. But you can never see them at the same time. However, now with Easy Annotate, you can view two PDFs side by side. And we'll show you how to do that right here. Let's open up Easy Annotate right here on the iPad, and we'll show you some of the features. In our default view, we've got one document displayed on the left-hand side and one on the right. Now these are actually the same material, but one is in English and one is in Chinese. So we can swipe between the different documents, which is great for navigating uh, individually. And we can also annotate these documents as we go. You'll notice at the, at the top left, we've got some open uh, options here. We've also got search options and export options. We've got those same options for the PDF that's displayed on the right hand side. Then more toward the middle, we've got bookmarking abilities right here within Easy Annotate. Let's go ahead and open a document. We'll show you how that works. Now we've got a few different options. First of all, you can open a document within Easy Annotate from another app using the built-in iOS open in feature. But if you have documents that are stored in Dropbox, we can go ahead and click into our, our Dropbox and drill down through the different folders here find the document that we want and open it up right here. So we're opening the document, it's loading it in from Dropbox right into Easy Annotate. Okay, there we go. So we've got our Watchtower open now and that's in uh, English here and we've actually got Draw Close to Jehovah book on the right hand side. So let's say we want to actually reverse that. Well, we can do that in the settings. Uh, which is in the upper middle section of the screen, we can go ahead and swap out those two PDFs. So if perhaps we prefer one to be on the right as and the other on the left hand side. Now we can also go in here and go into just view one document. And uh, if we go back into our settings, which is now on the upper right, we can go ahead and switch back to our two page or our two document view. So it's a nice way to see uh, two documents at once. We can also switch it back to one document and switch back and forth at that time. Now we can also turn on our night mode, which goes ahead and inverts the colors. So we can have a bit, little bit of a better view in the evening time if we're studying then. So we'll switch it back to our day view. And now let's show you how to create an annotation here. Now, in the center at the top, we have our annotation uh, tools that we can click on and it brings up a number of different tools here. Actually, six tools with, with six different colors that we can use. Highlight tool, underline, strike through, notes, drawing tool, as well as text annotation. So if we click on our highlight tool here, let's say we pick the green one, we can go ahead and start highlighting on the right hand side. Now we can also highlight some similar text on the left hand side at the same time. If we want to change pages while highlighting, we just do a two finger swipe. We can also zoom in to different portions of the document as well. And we'll go up to the top here. This time we're going to create a note. So we can touch anywhere on either side of the screen and create a note. So there's our note, and now it's right there and we can go back and view it at any time. We can also strike out some text. We'll do that here. We'll go, let me, perhaps we'll pick the red and we'll click on and highlight the, the uh, text that we want to strike out there. If we're in the annotation mode, we showed you how to change the pages using a two finger swipe. You can actually change the pages as well using these arrows in the upper uh, portion of the screen when you're in annotation mode. Now when you go back to just viewing mode, those arrows disappear because you can change the page just by simply uh, swiping your finger across the screen. 
We can also undo annotations here with our undo buttons up at the top right and the top left. Now let's say we have two documents here and we want to link the two documents together. So for example, on the right hand side of the screen, we have some text that we want to link to text on the left hand side of the screen. The way to do that is to go ahead and start selecting some text on the one side. We'll click the link uh, button there. Now we'll go over to our left hand side and we'll select text there. We'll say match link. So now this is create a link between documents so that if we start to change pages, we can go ahead and click on the right hand side link again. It'll bring us right back to that matched link in the left hand side PDF. Overall, P viewing two different PDFs at once is a great way to study two different languages or perhaps study one material with some reference material right on the other side. We really like Easy Annotate and we recommend it for viewing two PDFs at once.